Well, here's a video tour of the interior of my camper. It was originally a cargo trailer. It was just an empty shell when I bought it. The only thing that was there was this shelf that runs along the front. It's five feet wide, five feet high, and the floor is nine feet long. There's a baby bump in the front, and if you measure the baby bump as well, it's 10 feet long. I've got this wire rack, which takes up a little more than half the width. Leaves me plenty of room for a pass-through. I've got a little privacy curtain there that slides over. And this wire rack has a shelf that flips up to make a work area or to slide out the uh, stove. On the bottom we've got storage drawers, a five gallon bucket I usually have for bird seed. My trusty Coleman stove that I bought brand new in 1976. I just converted it to propane. Paper towel dispenser, little tote on top of the stove has pots and pans, utensils, aluminum foil, whatnot. Next shelf, you got more storage drawers, extra paper towels, gotta have a bottle opener, plastic bags for trash, another storage bin. Another storage bin on top, my coffee pot, storage drawers, paper plates up here, and silverware. And that's what it looks like from the back. Let's go in through the side drawer and I'll show you the rest. Well, here's the interior looking in from the side door. I've got a hanging wardrobe. Got jackets, heavy sweatshirts, my rain suit, and miscellaneous in there. Over here I've got a window that I put in. This thing didn't come with any windows when I got it. I also put in this window here in the door. And I made the curtains. With a lot of help from my friend Judy who sent me the fabric and gave me many pointers on how to sew. Uh, this thing's not insulated. It's pretty basic. I did put Reflectix on the ceiling. Eventually I'll insulate at least the ceiling. Again, this is pretty basic. No electricity. It's just one step above a tent. This shelf is what came with it when I bought it. More storage bins. Extra lanterns. My trekking poles. There's a golf umbrella over in the corner. My sleeping bag goes when it's rolled up. Underneath, I've got a little catch-all. This comes out with two bolts. Again, the whole concept of this trailer is to be able to convert it back into a cargo trailer in less than a half hour. And underneath this shelf is my Thetford chemical toilet. And over here is the bunk. The bunk comes out with three bolts. In fact, when I moved last year, we hauled a lot of stuff over to the new house one here. And underneath the wardrobe is my ice chest. I've got a soft cooler. This cooler has food in it. And then I've got storage bins for clothing, miscellaneous, and my fishing tackle tote in the corner. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed the tour. Thanks for watching.